Grandmother Clara Maize has been arrested seven times over the past decade for illegally mining precious stones in Kimberley in South Africa's Diamond Hub. Her defined patience has paid off and small-scale mining, an industry that employs many thousands of people, has now been decriminalized for the first time under a permit system. 77-year-old Clara Maitze was a Zama Zama, the South African word for an illegal diamond miner, until the government's recent landmark decision to begin decriminalizing the practice. The country was built on mines, both legal and illegal, and although a legal permit has made her life easier, Clara was never scared of being a Zama Zama. Yeah. No, why would I be afraid? The land belongs to us black people. I can't be scared. We already voted for Mandela. Clara, a former domestic worker, was arrested seven times in the past decade for daring to do the back-breaking task of solo mining while bringing up 11 children and several grandchildren. She is one of 800 miners based outside Kimberley in South Africa's Northern Cape province who have been given permits to mine a 500 hectare piece of land owned by a formal mining outfit. Yes, I think it's been a long time coming. Um, I think it's something that we always envisage could and should happen in the longer, uh, in the longer run. Deputy Mining Minister Godfrey Willifant has made legalizing small-scale miners like Clara his pet project, believing it will help fight mining crime and exploitation. When we gave them license, you could see the sparkle in their eyes. When we give them license to trade and deal with diamonds, you could see that you brought about a difference, positive difference in the lives of people. So we are, that's why we're excited. Elisa Lowe, a 47-year-old mother of five who joined the Zama Zamas in 2013 after her divorce, is another community member benefiting from decriminalization. Before the law changed, she mobilized her fellow illegal miners and lobbied the regional government for recognition. Yes, to have the permits is a miracle in our lives. It is a happiness for us all. The permits have opened doors that have been closed to us and built up our self-confidence. Zama Zama means to take a chance, and for years that's exactly what these small-scale miners have done. Tough living conditions and frequent violent clashes between miners and security forces have made life grindingly harsh. But these miners are hopeful that they'll no longer have to risk their lives to put food on the table.